rapid temp BT28, as the name suggests, goes down to minus 28 Celsius and all the way up to 225C. In addition to that really broad temperature range, the flow rate is really impressive as well. It'll go for anywhere from 4 to 14 SCFM. And that flow rate is available regardless of the temperature. There's no drop off in flow as the ultimate low is achieved. From an architecture's perspective, the BT28 is very similar to all the other larger thermal streams that Intest Thermal make. We take a source of compressed air into the rear of the system. We have a refrigeration unit that chills that air inside here. And then we have the cold air that's in this case around about minus 30 Celsius that comes down through the hose to where the heaters are at the end of the end of the arm and the heaters regulate that air temperature to the required temperature for your unit on the test. The user interface has a color touch screen that's really intuitive to use. You can control the system via the front panel or remotely over IEEE, RS-232, Ethernet or USB ports. If I want to drive it cold, you'll see I have a predefined cold set point of minus 28. I select it and you'll see the temperature here starts to descend towards that set point. Here we are, 5, 1, minus 2, minus 4, getting colder all the time, just as fast as all the other thermos streams that we make as we start to come in to the set point of minus 28. And if I want to drive it hot, I'll press this case to go to plus 200 C, and you can see this transitioned already at 74, 100 C. Now this moves really, really quickly. The BT28 will operate on 200 to 250 volts, 50 or 60 hertz. Uh, and there is a, for the US or North America market, there is a 115 volt version. Setting this system up on your workbench is super easy. You've got a really long reaching arm, um, which you can just lock into position. The thermal cap comes standard with the system and these thermal caps are compatible with any other thermal screen that we make. And so you just place it where it needs to be, lock it down, and you've got the added flexibility of this point on the thermal screen can slide left and right just to give you an even better reach. Here's some close-up detail of the slide on top of the system. You simply unscrew these, these bolts and then you can slide the, the, the collar left and right to give you even better reach on your workbench. Of course, when we're testing at cold temperatures, frost and moisture can always be a problem. And so the system comes with a purge system that flows dry air around the peripheral of the thermal cap to mitigate any frost forming. The other thing I want to introduce you to is because of the performance of this BT28, minus 28 to 225, 14 CFM. It opens up the possibility that for other applications outside of pure semiconductor tests can be used. And so these thermal caps are very easily removable. I can just take them off of the system here, slide it off the nozzle. And once the cap's removed, you can easily take a standard flex hose connect it to the thermal head and have it feed some form of an enclosure. So there we go. The Rapid Temp BT28, the most powerful, highest performing, quietest benchtop system on the market.